Hey there, everybody, and welcome back. So just want to do a quick video taking a look at performance between P3D version 3 and the new P3D version 4 now that I finally have the release candidate version. So with that said, we will not be looking at bass in terms of OOMs, but instead we'll be looking at the loading times and the speed of the simulator, along with, of course, its performance in terms of frame rate, I.O. usage, CPU usage, GPU usage, VRAM, as well as uh, some of the more objective things such as stutters. So to do that, number one, we have all the settings exactly the same with the exception of the LOD radius in P3D version 4, which did have to come down because it draws significantly further than version 3. Everything else is the same. Default AI traffic, only add-ons used with the Duke Turbine V2, Orbix, um, Southern California. And then we'll be flying from KLAX to KSNA from Latin VFR. So during that time, not only will we be looking at loading, as I said, we'll be looking at performance inside of the VC, along with performance outside of the aircraft, including performance during turns, which normally would induce stutters. We'll also be looking at uh, what happens when the simulator is sped up, simulating a high rate of speed and whether or not blurries and autogen popping occur. And then last, we'll be looking at ourselves approaching a large airport, which is KSNA, and seeing whether or not uh, we get stutters and uh, long loading times. With that said, we're running a 4.8 gigahertz 6700K with a GTX 980 Ti. It is running the latest 378.92 NVIDIA uh, drivers with no NVIDIA inspector and uh, 16 gigabytes of RAM. So uh, hopefully that makes sense to everybody when we're looking at this uh, performance chart. As you guys can see, I do have the performance graphs on both of the Sims. P3D version 3 is on the left version 4 is on the right as well as you also see the frame rate counters in the top right and top left hand side accordingly so with that said i'll let you guys sit back and enjoy the rest of the video if you have any questions please leave uh, me a question down below and until next time look forward to speaking with you guys soon take care